Hey, hello there. So good to be back with you again. Welcome to Creating Awareness. It's definitely a, one of the keys to your success. Another key to your success that I would like to share with you today is how to use awareness to move you forward. I'm Janine. I'm really grateful to be with you today as a social connector helping people to network so that they can gain time freedom and have choices in life. It's really awesome to be here with you today. I've been talking this week about various emotions and factors that affect our businesses and how we can improve the business through improving our skills in these areas. I mentioned being aware of a person's face, their personality, where they are and how we can use this to enable them so that we can increase our bottom line. I also discussed how you need to be congruent with your heart, your mouth and your mind because that is an awareness that the other person has of you. Well, today I want to share with you, I sat in a meeting on Sunday morning with some very high powered business people and what I came to realize is we need to have a really good awareness of trends, of the way things are going in the future, what's happening around us in the world. Not because we want to know about negativity, but we need to know when we need to start moving towards a trend that could benefit us more or something that would enable us. There are still people out here in South Africa who use donkeys and carts, but that's because they don't really have any other choice. The people who are in business for themselves and with themselves might do that on a weekend as an enjoyment factor, but here they've transitioned to using the internet, online business, uh, international business, whatever is needed to help us move forward, move our businesses forward. And that requires awareness. I sat listening to the CEO of this company and what I was picking up is five years ago, 10 years ago, he was already becoming aware of trends that were going to happen. I remember sitting in a meeting 20, 19 years ago and my husband said to this gentleman who one of his primary uh, the things that he sold was a learning a, a learning development a development self development course using tapes and CDs uh, tapes we didn't even have CDs at that time and I remember him saying to this guy and now let me put this in perspective Roland is not tech savvy at all he is learning because that's how the world is moving and that's where he's having to adjust to but the bottom line is he said to this guy surely we're going to be able to get things off the computer and at this time computers had actually just started they were just coming into fashion they had just come from you know in the home and it was just developing i'm giving away my age here but never mind and the bottom line was this man attacked him so badly never not a chance and he went ballistic at uh, roland do you know what happened um I'd say seven years down the line, we moved to CDs. And what happened past that? Instead of them having to post the uh, stuff from the States to South Africa so it could be put onto tape, I don't understand the process, put onto tape and then for people to buy, they now sent it on via MP whatever it was at the time, MP2, MP3, via the internet. So you know what? We need to always be looking forward, be present, Build your business now, but be aware of trends that are happening that can enable you to double your bottom line, triple your bottom line, to move forward and also to protect you because as we grow, as industry grows, as business grows and develops, so do the laws change because governments want their tax. They also want to protect the consumer, which I'm all for, but sometimes they want to protect the consumer to line their pockets. I didn't say that. Yes, of course I did. But you know what? The bottom line is let's be realistic. Everybody's in business and we're in business to make money. But we also need protection factors. So not only do we need to be aware of the trends that can enhance our business, we need to be aware of the various legal aspects that could down the line affect our businesses as well. It all comes down to be aware. And have a great day. I'm so glad I could get to spend time with you. Enjoy.